Hyderabad welcome East Bengal as we find ourselves in the middle of match week 10 in the Hero ISL. And on the line is top spot once again. You can hear the crowd. You can hear the crowd urging Hyderabad on to attack. Get at this side. Free kick given in favour of Hyderabad. Both very well organised. You, know, you can tell the coach works at them. You know, shadow player, whatever it is, he works the 11 v 11s and the relationships. He's just given another little free kick away there, Sue. Here, that's his second in, in as many minutes. Free kick, an opportunity for Hyderabad to put the ball into a dangerous area in the penalty box. Gal Victor and Yasser with clean strikers of the ball. Halicharan as well, we know what he can do. Might be a cross more than a shot, this one. Let up, in fact. Aberately worked out. Didn't look like they were all on the same page there. You could see where it was a set piece, three on the ball. They're going to play it out to the right hand side for one of the players that was on the ball to make a late run in the penalty box but it was all a little bit bitty if nobody was on the same page and weren't thinking the same way Ash with the throw in and falls to Hyderabad and falls onto the left foot of Mohammed Yasir. An idea tossed into the air and transformed by Hyderabad into the lead. That's exactly what the game needed. And if you go back to the throw-in where Mizra was concerned, he was reluctant to play it short. Now he's thinking, why are you not doing that? You can see it was obviously a set piece that they worked on. And it's not the first phase, it's the second phase. When you've got players on the edge of the box that know exactly if your man heads the ball, you get in the six-yard box. If your defender heads the ball, you're on the edge of the box to get the next phase. And just see Yazia's movement just wheeling around to the edge of the box, to that position, and it's a lovely technique. Left foot volley right in the top corner. Goalkeeper's got absolutely no chance, and it's just exactly what the game needed. How stylish is that? For Mohammed Yasser. He is a man in form. We always said it play with a smile on your face, and this kid plays with a smile on his face. Dayton. Oh, there's the flick on. Still in the box. Now Clayton. Once again. Oday away. Sumit Pasi. Referee says nothing for that. Chaotic at the moment. Avora. Wide rule into the feet of Borja. There's the ball into it. Severio, surely. And chance after chance. But finally, Hyderabad make it count. 2 0, Borja and Severio, the two subs combined. Breathing space for the coach. And I tell you, this should have happened about three or four minutes ago. It's a wonderful ball in. How Borgia is not in the team with what I've seen in the last 10 15 minutes is beyond me. The quality that he's put into that six yard box on numerous occasions, just inviting his striker to put the ball in the back of the net. And this time it's came off. It's given Manolo Marquez with five minutes to go a little bit of breathing space now. And here he is, here of the match. I think it was the moment in the first half that's got him this, you know. It was, it was wonderful, the, the finish that he put in to a, a simple set-piece, but it's just his movement. From that set-piece, he walks from the back post to the edge of the box, and there he is, appearing from nowhere, nobody on him. It's the technique that he puts the ball into the top of the corner. Fully deserved. Hyderabad fully deserved victory as well. Top of the table now. And there is a certain rhythm building to the way they're playing. It's not quite rock and roll, but a thundering pulse. Just know that something is building. At home once again and back to winning ways. East Bengal's travels 
not as happy this time around. At full time in Hyderabad, it is Hyderabad 2, East Bengal nil.